how to meet the great mother how to meet mommy water welcome to eye of ancestors kingdom miss me your queen and i ask uncle in your area family how are you doing i hope all is well with you and your family and all is well with your spiritual journey welcome so there is this question that came in it's not only from one person it has been coming in and i would like to meet the great mother i would like i would like to uh, um, uh, meet her and do this and do that oh okay it's not a child play yeah spirituality i always say it's not a child play that somebody will just get up and be like oh i want to see mami wata i want to see shango i want to see uh, yemoja i want to see uh, oloku i want to see ogun i want to see uh, uh, oshu i want to see uh, this i want to see that start with your ancestors you first start with your ancestors because they are the one that will be there for you in case you mess up with your deities and they want to punish you. Your ancestors will be there to plead on your behalf. So um, the question how to meet Mami Water for those who are really ready, you need to prepare yourself. You cannot just get up and just go to the ocean and start calling her name, thinking that she will appear. Then you are a dreamer. That's not how they do it. You yourself, when you want to learn, I'm talking about those who are ready, who want to learn, who want, who want to be devotees, who want to really devote their time for the great mother. You need to prepare yourself. But when you just want to do things anyhow, anyhow, you can pass somewhere, they can bring you there, do some things and do things very fast for you. That is where along the line you can go crazy and you can go mad too. Hmm? I'm talking for those who are ready, who really respect that energy, the energy of mommy water. And they want to learn more. They want to grow on their spiritual path. To show that respect to the great mother, she will always reward her children. Before going to the ocean or to the river or I don't know where, uh, um, uh, where you are, what is available, you need to take your spiritual bath. You need to cleanse yourself. Yeah, I always say, not that you just have sex or ladies, you are dripping, you are having uh, uh, your period, you are dripping and you just want to carry it and go to the ocean side. Especially ladies, when you are on your period, don't go. Yeah, any rituals that you want to do at the ocean when you are on your period, please, ladies, wait till you are okay. After maybe three days, let's say from three days going is okay. When it's not a thing that an urgent thing. Yeah, please wait. After that three days, you cleanse yourself and then you can go to the ocean or to the rivers to go and do your rituals. Okay, so. I said, you need to prepare yourself when you want to meet the great mother. The great mother hates dirtiness. I always say we have the dirty mariners. But the real clean, we have the real clean uh, 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 mariners. When you see them, even the way they will dress, when you enter their house, when you, um, their appearance, not even their appearance, appearance can also be fake sometimes, you know. When you go to their house, you, 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 will, you will see most daughters, even their altar, you will, you will know you will know it. Most daughters, or uh, uh, those who have the marine spirit, the water spirit, the water children, most of them are very clean. Why? Because that is the character of the mother. That the children also have it, and it's so beautiful when men are also that clean, super clean, over clean. <laughs> Yeah, so um, I said, you cleanse yourself. Hmm? You cleanse yourself. You take your spiritual bath. You can take your bath with, um, uh, how do you call it, with uh, uh, sea salt or with what you have, what is available. Uh, I hate it always to be saying do this, do this, because I don't know where you are on the other side of the world, of the world what is uh, available. Maybe some herbs are available um, 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 uh, Florida water, you cleanse yourself 
whilst you are, uh, you are you are taking your shower you keep on meditating you keep on chanting your affirmations and everything so when you are ready wear white only when maybe your spirit have told you otherwise wear white or blue and white you know your the color of your deities yeah my colors are white and blue i can wear both to combine or i can choose to wear only white or only blue all is up to me yeah that is when i'm going to the waters then you get your offering ready because you're not going there with empty uh, empty handed yeah you can get some fanta i'm just making examples here because maybe the spirit will tell you something else so i'm just making example here yeah you get some fruits like say pineapple watermelon banana oranges mm -hmm. you can get some biscuits you can get some uh, um, uh, some cookies right you can get some sweets i'm not saying tom tom we have a lot of different types of sweets don't go and bring any sour uh, 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 sweet or a uh, uh, house or this tom tom no sweets you know very sweet toffees you know you get some you get some beautiful nice perfume that smells very good good smelling perfume then we have this all the spiritual oils here on my side we have different different we have seven seven we have um uh, six flowers we have it's, it's a, 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 a lot of different ones so i don't know your side what you have I ask there so you get some when you can get some nice spiritual incense you get some so that when you go you use that one you burn it to secure your space you get some then uh, um i said fanta already you can get some some gin too you know some hot drinks some will go grow too you can get some uh when you like you can get some water you can get some sea salt they like it a lot somebody will say that but the tea is salt is full of salt already so for what do i bring the spirits they like it so you take that one along yeah when you can get a mirror a small beautiful mirror it's also nice then you take everything to the ocean yeah when you go you secure your space first you 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 meditate you invite your ancestors to guide you actually you do it at home even before you get there but when you get there do it do it once again invite your angels or um, uh, your ancestors or how you call them to protect you so that in case what you want to do now anything go go wrong there will be other spirits who are there to protect you you need that protection yeah so for me when i'm there i i used to sing a lot People, one day I will take my time and sing for you people. You will really love it. I have a very beautiful voice. <laughs> yeah. So you you uh, you start singing. You start chanting. You know, calling upon your deity. Whether it's mommy water, but the, the question that came in is uh, about mommy water. Yeah. You you keep on, maybe she has told you another name. Me have another name. It's not the name everybody is using. Everybody have a different name. Maybe she will give you. So when you know that one, why not then? You can call her by the name that everybody know or she you uh, you have her you keep on calling her you keep on calling upon her you know sing to her praise her you know talk about her goodness and all those things keep on chanting why you want to meet her and what is on your heart and everything i beg don't go there and be crying no, we don't need that one you know enough of crying when you go home you can cry but as far as you are there behave yourself Keep on chanting her name. Keep on calling upon her. And concentrate. Concentrate. You know, that perfumes, that everything that you brought, you can uh, uh, bring it now to the, uh, uh, into the ocean. You know, you can pour it in the waters. And then you come back. You keep on um, uh, meditating. You keep on chanting. You keep on praying. Or, and the rest will will um time will tell you know as you are there you keep on free your mind and free um how do you call it um uh free your heart from all grudges all negativity be pure as the water that you are going uh, uh, where you are standing you know be pure as, as that water as the water is flowing and i know she will surely review she review herself to her children those who are really ready 
So as said, she revealed herself to those who are really ready, willing, pure-hearted to um, see her. You know, and she'll reveal herself. When it doesn't work out the first time, then let it be a second time. Let there be a third time. Let there be a fourth time. Depending on your readiness, and you will have that encounter. All you need is to be ready. Don't compare yourself with anybody and somebody did it, didn't work, and somebody did it, and this thing. And when you really want to meet her, or you want to talk with her, then... Take your steps. Have your own experience. The other person who was talking, they had their experience. It's time now for you to have your experience. In spirituality, there is no limits. There is no limits. The only thing that is important here, be respectful. Hmm? Be very respectful. Behave yourself. Because these, these energies that we are talking about, they know everything. They feel everything. Before even you open your mouth, they know why you are there. But still, you need to. You need to talk. You need to introduce yourself. Yeah? Not that I, I'm coming here because one of my friends also came here. And uh, no. Know even why you are, you are going there to call upon her. You want to see her for what? All those things you need to be ready. So you plan yourself, you need to be ready, you need ready yourself before you go there. When you are going there, I said, don't go empty-handed. Prepare yourself. Ask questions. Depending on which deity, I'm talking about Mame Wata now. There are other deities, it's almost similar. And you need to know the day that you need to go there. When you want to have that encounter. You need to know which days are, 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 are is, uh, is good to meet the deity. There are days that even um, um, we are not allowed to go to the ocean or to some rivers. The other time I was saying it. You need to know all that. So the color is very important. The day is very imp important. Uh, uh, the things that your deity prefers or like so that you don't do a mistake. Maybe I'm talking about Fanta. Maybe your deity don't, uh, don't like Fanta. They like maybe just a strong drink. So all those things, you need to make your inquiry so that you don't do any, 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 any mistake. Then you yourself, as said, you cleanse yourself first before you go there. Mm -hmm. So that you are really prepared from home. Don't wear any dirty clothes and just go there. You are going to attract some funny, some funny entities. Because people think that, oh, the ocean is only mummy water where they in there. Please, not be only mummy water where they in there. There are other, other spirits, even the ones that even we don't know. When you go to, as, as I said, when you go to another place, they have names for it. They are different, 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 different. So you need to know which one you are calling. Whether you are going to the ocean to call upon Yemoja, she did there. Uh, uh, Mami Water, she did there. Oloku, she did there. There are other, other ones, other ones that, uh, that, 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 it's not only one. Yeah, so you need to, uh, to, to know really uh, um, which deity that you are, you are calling upon. The name is very important. Not that you go and call, <laughs> you go and call um, um, one deity, another deity will, will come out because the, even the name, you didn't say it right. You know, this is spirituality. Yeah. So I always say spirituality, we also need to add, we use our common sense. Mm -hmm. It's not that I guess you just do like this and things will be happening. And why my spirits say when I make a mistake, then they have to forgive, then they have to help me out. No. This journey, I always say, it's not for children. You two, you have to play your part. When you say that you are worthy for this power, for this authority, for this journey to be a chosen one, to be a called, a called one, then you need to play your part. And that is discipline. Respect your deities. Hmm? So this is what I can say for now for those questions that was the the question that was a lot a lot of people have been asking nana i would like to see my uh, uh, meet mommy water i would like to meet her you know for what you want to meet her yeah you know for what so this is the little that i can tell you this is how me too 
it has helped me a lot and um, the respect is very important when you are somebody who is fearful then I'll tell you that you should stop it. Don't even, don't even start. Just relax yourself and be doing your thing little and little at home as you have been doing it. But don't uh, go there. Oh, then some, ah, the time, the time, yeah. In the midnight, in the midnight is okay. Mm? Or very early in the morning. Let's say from five, six, yeah. Between, let's say five, six or six, yeah. It's okay. But not maybe 12 o'clock or 1 o'clock or 2 o'clock. No, no, no. In the night, night is the time that all the spirits, both the good and the ugly and the bad spirits, come out to come and do their things. You know, so night is very okay. When you can make it, even let's say at 3 o'clock, 3 a.m., hmm, when you have those balls, <laughs> when, when you have that liver, then 3 o'clock, and you are not far from there. It's also okay. And when you are going there, we are living in a generation that every smart thing people want to, uh, how do you call it? Um, people want to record. You know, don't try that one. Leave your telephone at home. Leave your telephone somewhere or just off it. Don't go and be trying to record anything. Yeah. So I'll stop here by saying much love from me, Nanaya Sankofa, in your area. On eye of ancestors' kingdom. Stay blessed. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe.